Illinois, I, I want to ask you, we've talked enough about Purdue, but Illinois did go into West Lafayette and, you know, they, they, they were in the mix. Well, a lot of teams would have gotten blitzed like that and been like, you know. Without Shannon, I, yeah. I have written them off to win the Big Ten regular season title. And people thought I was crazy. Illinois fans are crazy. But, like, th- to me, they have no chance of winning the Big well, Ten. Well, I, I don't think anyone does. I mean, I, right. I think Purdue is. Correct. They won it by unless, three games last year. They're better, and the league is worse. Unless the big boy gets hurt and knock on wood. Yeah. I mean, injury would be the one thing it. that could change that. That's, that's it. Like, Braden Smith suspension. or Zach Eady. Like, yeah. those are. If either of them get if they hurt, if they have their entire personnel, their entire complement of so, players, they're, so, I don't think they're going to lose. Here's my question to you. After seeing Illinois now, are they a team that could make a second weekend NCAA tournament? Uh, are they a team that could finish in the top three of the Big Ten this year? Or are they a team that's going to fall off now as time goes on and – they feel the effects of not having Terrence Shannon Jr., which, you know, again, most I'm, likely. I'm still, I'm still, the jury's out on the second weekend. Yeah. I think they're still an NCAA tournament team, and I think that they could finish in the top four or five in the Big is Ten. Is that more an indictment on on how weak the Big Ten is? That's part of it. But I, I do think that they, you look at their roster, and I still like their talent. I don't think that they have the top end of, of Terrence Shannon, who takes them to, like, the Final Four player. type team. But, you know, the ball has really moved. Damask is a, is a player. Gary, I saw Gary three times last year, and I just think his mentality at Illinois is totally different. I mean, he, he's a good player. Yep. Coleman Hawkins is a tough matchup for a lot of teams. The Ty Rogers point guard experience. It worries me. It I worry. Me and I, it had not hurt them until now. Purdue guarded them in a way that they had not seen. They just put Edie on Rogers and basically didn't guard him. Yeah. And I, you know, the copycat effect, that's going to happen every game going forward until you're gonna Ty Rondo. Rogers. You're going to run to him every I game. I mean, it's even, I feel like it's even more than that. Edie yeah. was at the charge arc. You know, Rondo's like a short closeout to like six feet. Right. This is like 18 feet. <laughs> like, he was basically and then it's going to get in Ty Rogers' head. It's going to no, get in his head. Agreed, agreed. That That's concerning. You know, they, they have Nico Moretti, who's coming back from a foot, but, you know, not having played, never really having been in the mix. I don't know how that is going to look. I like Luke Goody. I mean, I, I like their team. I mean, Me with too. Shannon, I really like their team. Correct. I don't know about second weekend, but they can definitely finish in the top four or five. Right now, I still think that it's like Purdue, I would say Wisconsin, Illinois, and then who knows? I mean, I was thinking Michigan State, but God, they, they were terrible last night. I think uh, like the third spot is, is going to just keep flipping. I, I yeah, think there's a lot yeah. of like, again, it depends on, you know, these stretches of, of, Who's at home for for stretches? Uh, who's healthy? I, I I just I I don't think there's much disparity between. No, I, I agree. And the, the ball has moved for them. You know they've got this yeah. the ISO yeah. <laughs> we, that Brad was so upset about last year for Penn State, but but now his players are are capable of doing it. He's like, I kind of like this offense. <laughs> um, and then defensively, they they guard and they they play hard. So yeah. I they force you into a lot of tough twos. And they're as good as just about anybody in, in the country from a two-point defense standpoint, like top 20. Yep. Um, so, yeah, they, they can finish in the top three or four of the Big Ten. I Second weekend, yep. maybe. I'm with I, you. Jury's, jury's still out. I don't know. I, I'm right there with you on both. Like, I don't think they're a second weekend team. I think only because the Big Ten doesn't have a lot of strength above uh, with, with Purdue. Somebody's going to have to finish third. 